Christmas book. Twas the night before Christmas when all through the house, not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care, and on Blue St. Nicholas snooped there. The children were nestled all snug in the bed, a vision of sugar pumps danced in their heads. And Mama our kerchief, and I and my cat had just settled down for a long winter's nap. When out on the lawn there arose such a clatter, I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window I flew like a flash. I tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow gave the luster a midday to uh, objects below. When what to my wondering I should appear but a major sleigh and a tiny reindeer with a little old driver so lively and quick. I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick, more rapid than eagles, his course as they came, and he was soon charming and called it by name. Now Dasher, now Dancer, now Prancer and Fixin, on Comet, on Cupid, on Donder and Blitzen. To the top of the porch, to the top of the wall, now dash away, dash away, dash away all. As dryly as step before the wall hurricane fly, and he made like an obstacle out to the sky. So up to the house top the coursers they flew, and sleigh full of toys in St. Nicholas. Achia! And then a twinkling I heard on the roof, the prancing and pawing of each nail hoof. As I drew in my head and was turning around, down the chimney St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur from his head to his foot, and his clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back, and he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. Okay, okay. His eyes, how they twinkle, his dimples that merry, his cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. His strong now mouth was drawn up like a bow, and the beard on his chin was as white as snow. The stump they piped, he held tight in his teeth, and the smoke in it circled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook like a laugh, like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby and blink, like a jelly old elf, and laughed when I saw him in his Sunday fault. A wake of his eye and twist of his head soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work, and filled all the stockings, then turned with a jerk, and laying a finger aside of his nose, and giving the nod of the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle, and away they all flew like a down of a thistle. But I heard him exclaim as he drove out of sight, Merry Christmas to all and to all a good night.